Franklin still here with us uh, as we get ready before we get ready to close out. Brad, tell them again who you are. I am the, uh, the marketing specialist for the city of Jackson, the Department of Human and Cultural Services, and I do booking and planning for tomorrow. That's what's up. And yeah. the reason why we wanted to talk to you is just to say thank you for letting us come out, man, and be able to talk no, to it, you. It, it was my pleasure, man. I'm just walking through here, man, just looking at the energy in the lobby out here, and uh, thank you all for coming. And uh, I mean, it was, it, was, it was a great opportunity for us to have Banner here. We're going to try to do more stuff like this. That's what's up with the city of Jackson and, and have the city involved in a lot more entertainment ventures like this and speaking engagement. So, you know, you guys just keep coming out to your Thiamara Hall, man. Keep supporting it. That's all we want you to do. Kudos to the success that you guys are having. Right. Thank you, man. And all the revenue over the time of years, the turnaround that you, you've done to the place. It speaks a lot because this is a, a it goes well, this beyond is, this Jackson. Is a, this, is a, this is a city building, so the revenue that we get from this building goes directly back into the city. So this city belongs to the people, and uh, you know the staff over here has worked very hard to turn things around, and we want people to be able to see that there is something successful going on in the city of Jackson. You know, with all the negatives that you think are there, there's something successful going on. This building is working, and we are turning this city into the entertainment capital of Mississippi. So if you want to see a show, you want to be entertained, this is the place where you need to be. It, international events are held here. The international events. We're getting ready to have the, the international ballet competition that we have here every four years. Uh, you know, we have this event. We've got floor tree coming. We have Robert Plant from Led Zeppelin and the Honey Drippers is going to be here tomorrow night. Uh, one of the things that almost held up this event tonight is because, you know, such a big event, you know, we try not to have them that close together, but we try to go you know, not to go an entire week with this building being dark. And that was, you know, one of the things that we said when I got here, and that's one of the things we've tried to maintain, that we have something every weekend, every week, and we want to be able to create a scene, not just on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, but on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday as well. You know, and even on Sunday, we had Paul Porter in here last Sunday, uh, had a fantastic crowd. So we want somebody in here every night. If it's up to me, we'll have somebody in here every night. It might not be logistically uh, possible, because of our backstage crew and they're working so hard, but you know we want to try to have somebody in here every day, man. And the more people we have in here, the more money that we make for the city. Right? And thanks for being a, 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 an ambassador for the city using this this facility, man. I, I, and I'm, supporting us too, man. Thank no, you. No, man. You know what I'm saying? We go back way. You know, we go way, way back. We won't say how far back, but we go, <laughs> we go way back. You know what I'm saying? All right. All right.